sacred capitals of Weshuma introduced me to Yurema. You know, when you're learning with some plants, then the plants introduce you to another ones. Shows you how you can continue with the uh, other plants and integrate all these spirits into your own spirit. Yurema, it's called by, uh, by the tribes in Brazil, in the Amazon jungle. It's their ayahuasca. The scientific name is Mimosa hostilis or Mimosa tepescohuite in Mexico. It grows in Brazil, Mexico, Guatemala. And uh, it's a plant that I uh, connect a lot. I had uh, very powerful uh, experiences in these uh, places with this plant. Mimosa or Yurema, it's uh, one of my favorite plants. It's very special. It can take you away from your body rather than Weshuma that shows the connection with your body. It's completely opposite. So Yurema shows you more about the spirit, shows you more about uh, dying. You know, uh, you die and you are in spirit interacting with different divine places, you know, that resides in, within you, you know, in, in, in different uh, dimensions. Yurema, it's a plan that, that shows you dying is not bad you can die so many times you can like meet your uh, people who loves and passed away you can see them yeah mimosa hostilis or yurema has a dmt as the main alkaloid and dmt it's a, an alkaloid neurotransmitter an hormone that uh, you even have it, have it in the lungs in the kidneys in the pineal gland you dream you are creating little amounts of DMT in your pineal gland that allows you to see these dreams but when you take DMT an exogenous DMT from the plant it creates such a uh, incredible amounts of uh, quantities of this neurotransmitter that uh, allows you to see with being aware being conscious because when you dream you are unconscious it's like uh, having a lucid dream you know you are awake but uh, you are interacting with the spirit. Yurema works in the pineal gland, in the crown chakra, the crown and the third eye. You know, you start like to receive guidance, a lot of intuition, you have a better vision. It's a, an amazing uh, antioxidant, uh, anti-neurodegenerative. It's an amazing plant that can neuromodulate all your circuits because you are getting into the field, you're, you're getting into the energy feel through the spirit and from the spirit world you start to change your body your life yurema is a powerful plan that in just like 10 15 minutes can allow you to uh, introduce you to these higher realms that reside in, within you to really understand that you are more than you think you are yurema or mimosa is also an acacia part of uh, these uh, 1,200 types of acacia. If we go into the Egypt, we see that the Egyptians, they were using also a type of acacia as, uh, as their way of DMT, as, as ayahuasca, no? as Brazil Yurema or Mimosa Stilis. All these plants carry DMT, that is uh, an alkaloid that we have in our pineal gland. When the person is uh, using DMT, through ayahuasca, through yurema, through different acacias, you are like working with your third eye, with your crown chakra. You start to receive a lot of guidance with your life, with your masters, you know, your ancestors, your roots. I think many people, they need this kind of, to press that bottom of reset so they can like choose again their beliefs. When they are, go away from this reality and they pass to another dimension, who they are on this dimension. They start to ask these jobs, this uh, family, all these, it just like goes in the Kai Pacha, in the middle world, because you cross the Hanan Pacha, where their ancestors, guidance, divinities are. Like we all are allowed to go there, but just once. Then you got to apply the world in order to meet them again. So Yurema is a very powerful plan that can connect with your guides, with the spiritual world. It can uh, make you a rebirth, you know, a bottom of reset so you can like 
start over again taking care about your thoughts about your beliefs about who you are you know i am creating a different way to access into the spirituality by a kind of a smokable ayahuasca and ayahuasca it's a way to create a spectrum so you can like smoke the dmt creating different blends of flowers you know sometimes i just walk around the mountains and choose the Tumbo Serrano, for example, which is a family of passion flower that carries flavonoids, beta carbolines, as ayahuasca vine, armelines, Pegano Marmala and Mimosa, both, one is the DMT and Pegano Marmala is Inhibitor. It's even three times stronger than ayahuasca vine. I uh, use the Pegano Marmala, I extract the alkaloid of DMT from the Mimosa and I transfer the DMT into the Pegano Marmala with the passion flower, with the lotus flower, with some coca, with some lavender, all these blend of flowers, it has a, a spirit. You know, sometimes when you smoke all these blend of flowers with the DMT that I struck from Mimosa, these flowers presenting your vision start to guide you. And there are several different uh, blends. You no, know? for example, there's blends that I use for the heart chakra. I use like coca, which works in the heart. I use reishi, that also works in the heart. Bobinsana, which is a plant that it's mostly used for dieting before ayahuasca to open your heart. I use lotus flower, calendula, hanyuka. Different blends affecting different power centers. 